The Niceties is such a thrilling and provocative play. And over the time that we've been working on the play, the world has changed so much. It's telling a story and it's ha these characters are having a conversation that I think everybody needs to be having. We both, you know, we both voted for Obama, our characters. But we are, go about seeing life as differently as you can possibly look at it. Wow. Um. You're saying that you think universally everyone who studied the American Revolution would disagree with me. Well, yes. You walk into the theater and you think to yourself, I'm either gonna be on Janine's side or Zoe's side, and you kind of have an idea of that. And it's always been so fun for me to watch the play and how the allegiances shift. I always feel very connected to the audience and I always feel very much like they were a part of, there were three people in the conversation. To imagine those men not knowing if they were going to pick Washington, struggling to figure things out. I would give anything to be in that room, wouldn't you? Um, probably not, no. <laughs> it's as important to have it on the Geffen stage as it has been on every stage that we've done. There were so many things that I had not realized were things that, that were painful for other people. You are oversimplified. I am so tired of remembering for both of us. I mean, this should be a pain that we share. I have been carrying all of this around on my own. We're both trying to get a few steps further down this road. And the most interesting thing is that it is two very different sides of the same side. Hi, I'm Jordan Boatman. Hello, I'm Lisa Baines. I'm Kimberly Senior. And I hope that you come and see the nice cities here at the Geffen Playhouse, now on stage.